Well, after that little rain that we had, things really greened up. Yeah, you know, it was going to happen anyway, and like down in this area, it's pretty damp. But after the rain, all of a sudden, just all the leaves popped out, you know. So it's kind of a jungle again. But I was looking, scheming. You know, along this stream, there's a kind of a path I'd like to be able to take with the tractor. Except when you get right up here, there's a kind of a, a hill that I would have to move with quite a little dirt. Uh, didn't used to be a problem, but the stream has kind of moved. You know, it used to be more over that way. So it's kind of interfering here. But I mean, I could dig, dig enough dirt out to get by. Got a lot of dead trees that I have to pull out of here. Which would make firewood. You know, it's mostly popple that have died off over the winter. And some elm, you know, that are just past their life expectancy. So it could all be done. But I was going to bring up something that I keep forgetting to mention. Uh, one of the channels that I watch. Uh, very regularly, and then I, <laughs> I think it's really interesting, is called Monkey Works. Now this guy monitors all the air traffic in the country, well, really around the world even. I mean, uh, the, anything that's going on, you know, there's always a public record of flights in and out of here and there. And you'd really be surprised, I mean, <laughs> some of the things that go on and, and places that we're flying into and out of, you know, that we really have no business doing. And some of that you always have to wonder who's really authorizing some of the shenanigans they get up to. But it's kind of funny, you know, like uh, these agencies that we have that are supposedly working for us are really kind of rogue. You know, they kind of do their own thing. Regardless of, of who's in power, it makes no difference. They're going to do their own thing. So it's kind of interesting to see, you know, if you actually look at uh, traffic patterns uh, of what's going on. So I would recommend, uh, you know, I've been watching that for, well, over a year. And you start to see little patterns uh, developing. But, it, like I say, it's very interesting. So I, I thought I'd mention that. You know, it, you, know you, you think... Well, you don't realize the level of surveillance that we're actually under. Uh, you really have no comprehension. And a lot of people really don't want to know. Um, but if you want to take a peek behind the curtain, that's a good place to look. You, you will start to kind of catch on what's going on. And so, you know, it's up to you if you want to if you want to know, or a lot of times, a lot of people are a lot, a lot more comfortable not knowing what's going on. But like I say, these agencies are, are really kind of rogue. In fact, there's, you know, at least in theory, these agencies have to answer to somebody. But at the same time, out of the Pentagon, there's like a virtual army of people that aren't responsible to anybody, that are kind of uh, freelancing this thing. Um, the purpose of them is that they can be denied. You know, if they get caught doing something they're not supposed to be doing, uh, they can say, oh, well, he doesn't work for us. Never heard of the guy, you know, but there's a bunch of them that are, that are doing that. 
but you know some of the stuff you really don't you know if you want to sleep at night you really don't want to know it but you know people always ask me why do I have multiple phones because some of the phones that I have the phones that I use like if I if I leave the place I'm, I'm taking with me a phone that has no GPS on it, no tracking capability, has no internet on it at all. But that's because this whole thing now with with all the surveillance that's being done on us, we made it easy for them. With these smartphones, they know everything that they know more than they want to even know. I mean, they've got information coming out of their ears. But it's all there to be used against you. It's not to your benefit, it's to be used against you. But a good place if you really want to just take a peek at what's going on. You can look at that channel. You know, watch it for a while and, and you kind of get to see what's going on. He does a really good job on, on just monitoring air traffic. Basically that's what he's doing. But it tells a story.